Halo, halo, cześć, witam wszystkich bardzo serdecznie. Z tej strony oczywiście wasz ulubiony piżamowy Czesław. No i słuchajcie, kontynuujemy historię z gry Life is Strange Before the Storm. Nie pamiętam, co miałem zrobić. Ja w szoku. Co miałem zrobić? Rozmawiać? A, kurczę, a, jedziemy do szkoły. Kurde, kiedy to było? No dobra. Kurczę, strasznie niewygodnie mi w żadnej pozycji. Ani w takiej. 10 metrów i nic No point in putting off the inevitable torture of driving to school with David. It's better get going. Tak, to jest skrzywiony i wszystko mi później napierdala. Nie ma żadnej dobrej pozycji na ekranie w komputer. O, wiadomo. Czy to Chloe? Z tej strony Stef i In 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 Jean Grish Hej Mam twoją płytę, mogę ci ją dać przed lekcjami Dzięki No dobra, to co? Chyba chodźmy Chcę w ogóle poczytać o tym Square Enixowym silniku Daje się całkiem spoko. What a piece of crap. The car too. Nie, no co ty gadasz? Absolutnie klasyka. Why do you women always take forever to get ready? We're hoping you men will leave without us. No, mom. I swear he beat himself to death with a tire iron. Repeatedly. <laughs> Chloe, is that a black eye? No. <clears throat> Insubordination. No wonder your mother's worried about you. Oh, that's sweet. When I was your age, I'd gotten to my share of scraps. But it's not responsible. You owe it to your mother to do better. Tell me again what I owe my mother, dirtbag. Electrode insulator's probably cracked. You know what a spark plug does? Yes. It ignites Did you not the hear me? I said I know what it does. Then go grab my socket wrench set from the garage, and we can get moving. Tuż na sadowy. Hmm, What is this? Quality time? Ugh. Better just get the socket wrench and get this over with. Dobra. Tuż na sadowy. Prosta piła. O. What's David doing, leaving stuff in our garage anyway? Does he think he's moving in or something? Chyba tak. ten garaż. Should fill this with gasoline just in case David's car ever catches on fire. Damn. The stereo used to be in Dad's workshop. I should hook it up in my room before garbage day gets it first. Mleko w puszce? Fasola klasyczkę. Sos pomidorowy. Makaron. Klasyka w razie kursy wojny atomowej. Ta, kurwe fasoli. Na, mam nadzieję, że naprawiłem mikro. Widziałem, że w poprzednim odcinku to uh, uh, jak robot. This was the photo mom took down from the living room. Guess we don't have room for it and David's mustache. Do these have chapters on hot wiring your mom's boyfriend's car so you can drive it off a cliff? Asking for a friend. By toolbox, did David mean this or did he mean himself? David's lawnmower. Maybe mom and I like our lawn the way it is. Ever think of that? Długa trawa koks. Dad's toolbox. He used to get so excited whenever anything sprung a leak or busted.
There's his stupid socket wrench set. <sighs> Let's get this shit show over with. 50-50 chance I smash him in the face with this. 60-40. Maybe 90-10. Ja, mogę się przejść? Nah. School's hardly worth walking to. Okej. Sprytnie. A trzeba pozwiedzać. No tak. Spójrz. Does Max picture me pathetically checking this mailbox every two seconds for letters that never come? No love for Chloe. Nah, school's hardly worth walking to. <laughs> nah, school's hardly worth walking to. No, warto było sprawdzić. Nie lubię patrzeć po takie rzeczy. A bo a to, to jeszcze możemy sobie do domu wejść drzwiami. Co? Nah, school's hardly worth walking to. No dobra. If I don't bring David his wrench soon, he might explode. Not literally, but it's a nice thought. Mm. Uh. So, you find the socket wrench set yet? You can do that one simple thing, can't you? Mom should date literally anyone else. A little more hustle wouldn't have killed you. See what's gunking up the works there? That's a sign of carbon, carbon deposits. Power. No shit. You know, you could actually be good at this if you lost the attitude. My attitude is what makes me special, David. All right. Strasznie dziwny skład. Tak jest szczerze. Niech tak stoi. Nie no, żółwi, co? Whatever. A, da się. Jedne ładne, ła, łatwej roboty nie ma. Umówmy się. To ja gram Chloe. Hey, you're taking those tools with you, right? Every house needs a good toolbox. No kurde, ty. Smakuje identycznie, jakby <laughs> wziął sos z gołą. But thanks. <laughs> Identycznie. Przecież wiem je jadłem, więc wiem jak smakuje. Holy shit. Nie nawet dobre. Ready to roll. Please don't want to talk. Please don't want to talk. Please. I want to talk to you about something. Fuck. We don't have to like each other. But you will respect me. You've enjoyed enough of a vacation from having a father figure. So there are some things I want to be real clear about. Respect him? I think it's time I show this asshole I'm not interested in anything he has to say. That's my Lubena What's Mijerka. clear is fuck you. Language. You are way out of line, young lady. Language? I'm sorry. I can't take you seriously with that mustache. You're so smart. Bad you don't know who you're dealing with here. Zaga, it's someone my po punkcik. Is this goopy? Rosset no da niema z mikrodzie. Let me dumb it down for you. Yes. I mean, sorry. What has fewer syllables than dumb? Hey, watch your I can crap bigger than you, got it? Then I hope you're a better plumber than you are a mechanic. You your mother breaking her heart. At 
least she has a heart. All you have is... I'll What's it ahead. called when you've got one porn stash and zero game? I was in the army. You will respect me. I don't remember enlisting, so don't treat me like your newest recruit. Look, now, in this house, I have my job to do, and so do you. Do I come to your place of employment and... Oh, that's right. You don't have one. If you were a man, I... It's cool. If you were a man, I wouldn't go so easy on you either. Why I bother trying? Mission accomplished. Yes. Yes, no, no, ba. Na właśnie po sobie się zapomniałem. Country. Music. Country road. Take me home. I'd love this song. I'm to my is za cicho teraz. Raz, dwa. Nie wiem, jeżeli coś jest źle, to naprawię to w następnym odcinku. Wracać. I know what a spark plug does, jerkwad. This... this isn't right. If mom were here, she'd tell him to turn that junk off. Out of the car, Chloe. You're gonna be late. Mm-hmm. Half mission. Um. Shit. Thanks. Don't use that sarcastic tone with me, young lady. I can see you rolling your eyes. Uh, hello? I was actually saying I see everything. I'll warn everything. Hello, Black Hell. Now we're going to be able Hey, Chloe. Oh, hey, Elliot. Wait, what happened to your face? Do you need to go to the nurse or something? What? This? You should see the other guy. Guess it's true then. I heard you had a hell of a night. I mean, people are talking about it. People can eat a dick. 
Even social media haters can't ruin how awesome last night was. So, how about The Tempest? Blackwell Theater at its most pretentious. Yeah, totally. I know it's gonna be lame, but I was thinking, do you want to go together tomorrow? I try to make it a rule not to go to school any more than I have to. But sitting in the back row and making fun of the drama kids might not suck. Right? That's totally what I was thinking. All right. See you in chem. Yeah, for sure. Mm. That goes so vim though. Gotta track down Steph to pick up my DVD. I've still got time before class. Tego co wiem, to Chloe to tak średnio z no, Chloe. Class is back płcią przeciwną way. chyba. Już nie pamiętam. A tak mi się wydaje. A ja siedzę z Mikim przy stoliku piknikowym. Dzięki już idę. Matthews, Blackwell's finest. He's not so bad for a mall cop. Hey, Skip. Stopped any gang wars lately? Not today. Oof. Looks like you did, though. Huh? Ah, right. Whatever. I did ask Justin Williams' mom to move her Mercedes out of handicapped parking. That ass. Yeah, you know how I roll. <laughs> so, I went to the mill last night. Caught Firewalk live. You went to the mill? Wait, you saw a firewalk? It was cool. Whoa, pretty wicked. I didn't know you were into music like that. What? Like good music? <laughs> Preach it, sister. I'm in a band, actually. No shit. Really? We're called Pisshead. It's not a big deal or anything. I mean... I mean, I'm trying to get our demo out there, but it's hard. Miss Head, huh? W would you maybe want to hear it? Our demo, I, I mean. Rosta. Yeah, okay. Great. Jak jest zajrane. So, what did you think? That was really good, man. If Pisshead came on the radio, I'd turn that shit up. Oh, right on. Awesome, Chloe, thanks. Jeśli prawy przycisk... Ojejciu, ale mi się... Ja też wszystko na łapy zapisywałem. No. To jest takie true. Zadanie domowe na jutro. Na ręce. Po szkole zrobić to. Na ręce. Jeśli zanieść nauczycielowi z chemii to. Na ręce. Zawsze. Zawsze miałem całą łapę popisaną. Nie wiem czy tak robiliście, ale opa. Miss Grant, najbardziej lame teacher at Blackwell. Wish she could get over the whole push me to succeed thing, though. Zawsze zapomniałem zrobić zadania domowego. Zawsze w 95%, ale jak zapisałem sobie na ręce, zawsze zrobiłem. Morning, Miss Grant. Chloe, are you all right? Yeah. We need to have a phone. Yeah, that was really just a zap study. 
What do you think of this hypothesis? That you'll be in your seat by the time chemistry class begins today. I wouldn't miss it for all the manganese in the world, Miss Grant. Your sincerity's overwhelming. With all the change that's happening at Blackwell of late, I suppose I can appreciate your consistent wit, Chloe. What kind of change do you mean? Well, the Prescotts have made an extremely generous donation to the school, which is good, but instead of going to support more science and mathematics, it's all being dedicated to the arts. You don't think more money should be spent in the arts? It's not that exactly. I recently made the case that STEM programs should receive more support, but apparently our new donors disagree with me. Such is life, I suppose. Miss Grant actually seems sad. Maybe in another six months, a new donor will come along with money for, I don't know, more lasers. More lasers? Do we have any lasers? Sadly, no. That is sad. <laughs> I'll see you in class. Right, Chloe? Pewka, pewka. Egzaminy końcowe. I prefer to wake and bake. But hey, to each their own. Hmm. Uczniowie Blackwell, nie przegapcie najważniejszego posiłku dnia. Zadbajcie o swoje ciało w czasie, gdy narażone jest na stres egzaminacyjny. To śniadanie, tak? Ja nie wiem, czy takie śniadania są dobre. Wydaje mi się, że, <coughs> że tak średnio no, generalnie. Chloe. Class is back the other way. Uh, but fire's so pretty. Hmm. Potwierdzam. Zadbaj o swoją ochronę przeciwpożarową. To jak byłem mały, to wszystko chodziłem i podpalałem. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Powiedz nie dla dragów. Aha, dobrze. Zwycięstwo na dopingu nie jest zwycięstwem. To szybka droga na dno. A, bo to jest chłop. Tak ujnie. Okej. Swimming pool. No, 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 pamiętam. Jest pamiętany swimming pool. To dziwnie wygląda na wszystko. <laughs> no z tyłu stoją takie 2D postaci Kurczę no Chociaż na ustawieniach na maksa to mogli coś wyciągnąć z tego myślę Myślę, że mogli dać do pieca Ale Huh Weirdly That makes me interested in walking on the stage Co? Wbijamy co? Na scenę jak? Hmm. Jak sprawić, by Chloe podniosła nogę? Need my DVD oh. from Steph. I bet she's nerding it up with Mikey somewhere. Zatkie brzuski. Usiąść? Eee. No, możemy sobie wycidować. Ja szkoda, że się kamery nie da odnaleźć. Taka za blisko jest. I should probably be getting to class, but I just don't care. Did last night really happen? The internet says it did, but I still can't believe it. Rachel Amber. The drama star, honor student, popular princess of Blackwell. Swoops in like a Batman to save my ass and thrash to firewalk? Either that was a dream or real life just got a shit ton crazier. Oh. 
Principal Wells. Hey. Chloe Price. Is that a black eye? I'm, uh, yep. I hope you know that Blackwell provides confidential counseling services for all our students. We are a safe space for any issue. I'm good. It's the other guy who needed a safe space from me. As you never fail to conform to your reputation, do you? Miss Price, the sign clearly says do not walk on the stage. Such disregard for your fellow students' efforts won't alleviate your record of major infractions. How many minor infractions and a major one? This is no joke, Miss Price. Who's joking? You've seen my math grades. Perhaps you will find me less amusing if I mention the various allegations I've been hearing about your drug use. You know Blackwell has a zero-tolerance policy. Do I have to initiate a search of your person in order to establish the veracity of these allegations, Miss Price? That's what I thought. I'll look forward to seeing you in my office after school today. How does that sound? Dobra. All right, sir. I'll see you after school. I'll count the minutes. That guy's a tool. No dobra, to daj, to ja sobie zadzwonię do mamy. No to dał mi telefon taki szkolny. Taki wiecie, co się podnosi, trzu, no nie? I... Zadzwonię do mamy i mówię... Students at Blackwell have this herd instinct to glom up into little groups, like sheep. And if you just want to be alone, you get labeled like some dangerous outsider. Just like any other prison. That's a bunch. Except now the prison follows you wherever you go, thanks to social media. I can't believe Rachel posted a photo of the two of us together last night. Am I still an outsider if I'm hanging out Hello. with Rachel Amber now? And what does it mean that hanging out was so awesome? Does that make me just the same as every other student here? Nah, fuck that. Dobra. I i dzwonię i pytam, czy mnie zwolni, a bo bo. Jakbym dostał, były trzy sprawdziane naraz. <głos> Nie wiem. A trzy sprawdziane naraz na jednej lekcji były. I tam już były wagi w ocenach, jakby tam. I to były najwyższej wagi. A ja, byłem, a ja wiedziałem, że dostanę trzy papcie najwyższej wagi. No i nie idę dalej. Nie, nie ma szans, że to, że to naprawię jakoś. Nie ma możliwości. I szczególnie, że to taka była pani. No. Więc... Mówię mu tak. Patrzymy sobie w oczy. Mówię do niego... 10 lat miałem, nie wiem, 12, 13. Mówię... Nie, 13, 13, 14 może. Mówię, a co jeżeli... Ja bym sobie teraz wyszedł. <laughs> On mówi, nie możesz. Ja mówię... I bet Steph and Mikey are playing games on one of the tables. Ale mówię, ale hipotetycznie, jak teraz poszedł. A on mówi, ale nie możesz. A on mówi, ta? To pa. I tam było takie wielkie okno, gdzie było widać, jak ktoś wychodził i wchodzi ze szkoły. Wyszedłem i tym oknem tak tylko spojrzałem i poszedłem do domu. Z jakiegoś powodu nie miałem o to większego przypału. It's nice that Elliot always wants to do stuff with me. I just haven't been in the doing stuff mood lately. Każdy miał gorszy dzień. To był fatalny dzień. See you in class. I 
I can tell Justin's wearing his eau de gange. Damn, girl. That eye looks sick. What's going on? Hey, out of the blue question, what do you think of Rachel Amber? She is amazing. Uh, if you're into chicks that are hot, smart, and hot. <laughs> I mean, she helped me out a while back. I was failing algebra hard. I believe you. Check it. After I bombed my midterm last fall, she tutored me for the rest of the semester. And then I crushed it. C+. <laughs> Last night, I scoped out this crazy party at the old mill up north. Kind of a DIY thing. Wow, no shit. I thought that place was like, meth central. My cousin met this hooker there, Whatever. And... It was cool, okay? You wouldn't understand. All right. Guess I'll see you in class. Word. I can tell Justin's wearing his eau de gange. Ivan. Need my DVD. Chloe, I'd like to talk to you about wildfire awareness and prevention. Good morning to you too, Evan. According to the Department of Forestry, over 90% of this season's fires were caused by humans. That's a record high and completely preventable. This is for college, right? I don't believe you actually care about this. My interest in fire prevention is completely sincere. Besides, I intend to get into college on the strength of my photography alone. Do you think Rachel Amber would be willing to pose for my portfolio? She's so artistic. I bet she would be a dream model. What do you think? I guess. Who says we should prevent fire? Fire is awesome. While I realize you're being purposefully obstructive, you raise a good point. Many parts of our local ecosystem benefit from fire. Knob cone pine cones, for example, which require temperatures above 350 degrees to open. Say knob cone again. No. I gotta run. Wait, one last thing. Will you sign my petition to have a fire safety assembly at school? <sighs> sure. I love assemblies. Some of the best naps of my life. Wow, thanks. I did not see that coming. You being, you know, interested in complicated issues, helping out with the public. Do you want me to change my mind? I... No. How seriously am I taking this right now? <laughs> there you go. Just don't expect this to become a habit. Blackwell Academy, home of tomorrow's leaders. Big Mac huge balls. Principal Dix. What? Caring about important issues? Caring in general. A było Hierozielskiego wpisać. Na nic. Blackwell Academy. Home of tomorrow's leaders. O, pamiętam to miejsce. No, Chloe. Class is back the other way. Stała się tu. Ta... Już nie pamiętam co się stała. Ale wiem, że tu się mogła stać rzecz jedna. Pójść. Steph Gingrich and Mikey North, Blackwell's premier indoor kids. Steph has created something of a business selling pirated DVDs to other students. If I had known the Celestial Avenger was bloodied, I would have totally given him my potion. It was a skill challenge. Potion wouldn't have worked. Skill challenge? It's part of the tabletop game we play. You wouldn't understand. Give me a break, nerds. I've heard of tabletop games. Cool. 
Got my DVD. One Blade Runner. Director's cut coming right up. Sweet. Five bucks, right? Keep it. I'm just glad someone here appreciates the classics. You even asked for the director's cut, which took out the shitty voiceover and replaced it with a sweet dream sequence. Dream life over real life. That's my motto. Right on. Hey, do you know if Rachel's a gamer? Rachel Amber? You're asking me? Didn't you two go out last night, or was it just like a friend thing? Why do you want to know? <laughs> Steph has a crush. Chloe, you should join her game. Yeah, I don't have 50 hours right now. Thanks, though. <laughs> We're at the end of the campaign, so it'll only take, like, 20 minutes? What else have you got to do before class? Beth can sit back. What the hell? Game on, nerds. Here's a character sheet. You are an elf barbarian. <laughs> mm -hmm. Are you insulting me in some obscure nerd way? <laughs> Think about it. An elf? Like skinny and kind of weird, but also a barbarian, so like really. Angry. In other words, Chloe Price. Wow, you two are a riot. All right, let's get started. You are both famous heroes in the kingdom of Avernon, a once peaceful land now laid to waste by the bloodthirsty raiders of the Black Well. Alone, you have fought your way through the raider camps, seeking their warlord leader, Durgaron, the Unscarred. As you enter the final camp, bloodied and weary, you see your fellow hero approaching from the opposite direction. I raise my staff to you in greeting. I am Elamar, wizard of the Third Circle, foremost advisor to King Tiberius, and sworn defender of Avernon. <laughs> Introduce your character. Yeah, okay. Uh, I'm an elf barbarian named... Uh, um... Uh... Chloe. Chloe, <laughs> really? What? <sighs> the two heroes. Hold on. Elamon narrows his eyes at the elf in front of him and says, I am here to defeat Durgaron, the Unscarred. In the name of King Tiberius, what makes you think you are worthy to fight alongside me? Someone stabbed a guy in the chest with a sword, and it went all the way through and killed the guy behind him, too. True story. You stand at a three-way crossing. <laughs> well, to your left, cool. the raiders' training ground. To your right, their prison camp. Straight ahead, an enormous, ostentatious tent that could only belong to Durgaron, the Unscarred. Which way do you go? Straight ahead, right? We're supposed to kill the Dur dude. Elamon frowns. The raiders could have some good loot at the training ground, and surely it is our duty to free all those prisoners. Your choice, newbie. Where do you wish to go? Hmm. Guess it's time to free some peeps. Let's go to the prison camp. You behold a field of standing iron cages each imprisoning a human villager, calling out for you to free them. Only a small, elderly dragonkin is keeping watch. He notices you, and in terror, runs into one of the few empty cages and locks himself in. Ah, poor little guy. What's a dragonkin? Dragonkin are like little dragon people. They're assholes. I bet he has all the keys. Oh, okay. Hey, shitface, get out of there. The dragonkin hops up and down, shaking his ring of keys at you. He shouts in a strange language. Whatever he's saying, probably isn't flattering. Got any useful spells in that robe of yours? Nothing that wouldn't blow up the cage and everything in it. Intimidate. That's a skill I have. 
Can I do that? I want the little bastard to shit his pants. You can try. What do you say? Listen up, you little lizard. Unfortunately, he doesn't speak common, which means he I can't- I cast communication on the dragonkin. Shit. Really? Now he can understand every word you say. Time to work some real magic. So this is called a skill challenge, where you try to use- Oh, I know what this is. I grab the bars of the cage and lean in, nice and close. He steps back, his scaly skin quivering in fear. What do you say? I wiggle my hand. Hey, dragonkin guy. Want to become my meat puppet? How it works is I shove my arm up your ass into your head, and then I can control your mouth from the inside to say things. Uh, he doesn't seem to like that idea. Neither do I. The dragon can plead with you. Please don't harm me, tall one. But I cannot give you key. Durgaron, much taller and meaner than you. Maybe we'll just wait here while you die of old age, dragon kin guy. He is undaunted. I will eat your face, elven garbage lady. Elven garbage lady? Eat my face? I'm trying. I want to reach through the bars and grab the stupid key. You try, but he's incredibly agile. He dodges your clumsy attempt with ease. Then he laughs. This tabletop shit is hard. Try playing solo. The dragonkin swallows the key, pointing at his stomach and then his own butt, laughing at you. Then he... I shove my axe through the cage, right into his stomach. Then I twist it, and then pull it out. His guts and shit start falling everywhere, but I jam my hands inside his open stomach, grabbing the key. Then, in the final moments before he dies, I hold the key up to his face. And then I laugh. Normally, I'd say you failed the challenge, except that was so horrifically amazing. You won. Yeah, go team. Why don't you start unlocking the prisoners? I'm on it. As you free them, the prisoners run away from you in fear. What's next? Mm. Loot sounds good. Let's go to the training ground. Sweet. Upon arriving at the training ground, you are spotted by a heavy set orc who immediately shouts and points. There are a dozen raiders on the training field, all of whom raise their weapons and charge. Okay. So what do we do? I cast Urgle's Acid Blast. Um, overkill? Bam! You conjure up a wave of acid that washes over the charging orcs. Every raider suddenly starts screaming and writhing in pain. There's a sweet and sour kind of smell as the flesh melts off their bones like warm candle wax. Holy shit. You see why I haven't really needed a partner? The heavy set orc sergeant still remains. He runs at you swinging a massive warhammer. All yours. Nie za bardzo słuchałem niestety. Rozrąbanie. Okay. Let's end this. Fatal cleave. You swing your great axe downward with both hands. The orc blinks, then splits open like a hot dog bun. Oh, Fuck yeah! I'm awesome at this game. It's going well. What about the loot? Well, as the training ground is now a roiling pit of acid, it's unlikely any loot survived. Dang. My character raises her axe. You'll pay for ruining all that loot, Elamon. By my honor, I apologize. Here, take this potion as a gift. Thanks, dude. What's next? It's tent time. You enter the tent to find Durgaron, warlord of the raiders of the Black Well, sitting comfortably at his throne. He's a huge red-eyed minotaur, swathed in a fine black cloak, 
gripping a two-handed sword that's easily six feet long. His laughter bellows. Wah, ha, 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 ha. Your lands and people are already mine. Mauvais, ça, Your deeds here mean nothing. Your kingdom was weak. You are weak. <laughs> what an asshole. I got this. I cast Zael's cataclysmic cone of fire. The fire fizzles out on contact. Durgeron laughs again, holding up his right arm to show off his bracer of fire immunity. Shit. All of my battle spells are fire-based. Except for, you know, Acid Blast, which someone used unnecessarily to show off for Chloe. Chloe? What'll it be? Hmm. Niszczące uderzenie. Oh, holy shit! Uh, annihilation strike. That sounds boss as fuck. One? Oh. That's bad, right? Not for me. As you take your first step, you trip on a rock, collapsing onto the ground in a clangy jumble of metal. Your axe swings wildly to the side. Mikey, roll a reflex save. Oh no. Three. Your axe strikes Elamon's leg. Um, legs. Plural. Severing both feet at the ankles. I am so sorry. Durgeron moves toward the crippled Elmon. Oh, shit! I told you this was my best boss. You didn't tell me my character might die. Durgeron approaches, stomping his bloody hooves. Stomp. 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 This is all my fault. Sort of. What should I do? Hmm. Scotch. Tanets. Eh. Tanets? No. Got some set Elamona. Jump in front of Elamon. Wow. Thanks, Chloe. Okay. Durgeron has now turned his attention toward you. Bring it. He charges, thrusting madly with his great sword. Shit! Oh no. Your attempt to dodge his thrust fails. Durgeron laughs as he impales you on his blade, lifting you high into the air. Seriously? I can't do anything with that stupid bracer. I'm sorry, Chloe. Hey, I chopped your feet off. And we're even. You feel your strength draining away as Durgeron lifts you higher into the air. It hurts like hell. What do you do? Uh, I take one last <gasps> swing yeah. at Durg... Dur Durface's head. You have to roll high to hit. You're almost dead. Oh no. Hmm. Eleven. You swing catching Durgeron on the side of his head, severing oh. one horn. But Było you don't branka. do enough damage to kill him. What an asshole! Było he branka. laughs, then rips you off his sword with a vicious jerk. You die painfully. Eh, so like mean. <laughs> I'm sorry, Chloe. I have to escape. Hey, man. If you can, do it. I cast Warden's Hideaway. You sure? It's all I've got. You summon a spectral door, which shields you from Durgeron. Light flares out, blinding him. The door swings shut, then disappears. You are gone from sight and cannot be haunted. I guess I'll have to come back when I'm stronger. That was fun. Check out what I drew. Mikey's got serious drawing skills. Eh. Od Azy, on to teraz narysował, to my, no to on. No, Sorry, I died and left you out there to fend for yourself. It's cool. I'll get him eventually. Glad you enjoyed it, Chloe. Yeah. I'll adventure with you anytime. <laughs> we'll see. Thanks for the game, nerds. Thanks for the game, nerds. Thanks for the game, nerds. DVD, check. Next stop, chemistry class. A propos tej szkoły i tego co gadamy o tym wszystkim, właśnie dostałem suszone jabłka od nauczycielki. <śmiech>
Reset. <laughs> 8 lat. Dziętki. <laughs> Dziwne strasznie. Ale... No to. Słodkie. Thanks again for the game, Chloe. Super fun. Next time will be even better. Dobra, mam, mam nadzieję, że... Znaczy, znaczy nie, w sumie to... Mam nadzieję, że jeszcze są jakieś interakcje. Ale... From late to class, that's just one more excuse for mom to sit David on me. A są jeszcze interakcje, no. Dobra, ale mamy już 50 minut odcinka. Więc ewidentnie trzeba tutaj zakończyć dzisiejszy odcinek. Mam nadzieję, że wam się podoba odcinek i... Mam nadzieję, że podoba wam się też fakt, że eksploruję giereczkę na 100%. No i takie gameplay znajdziecie u mnie, a że przez 30 minut w grze gra się w grę. No to już trudno się mówi. Ja też się bawiłem dobrze, pewnie oglądałeś to strasznie kijowo, ale... No, ja się bawiłem dobrze. A kto się bawi dobrze, to zapraszam jutro o godzinie 16. Miłego dnia, moi drodzy. Przypominam o w górę komentarzach, subskrypcja też. Instagram w opisie. Miłego dnia, miłej nocy. Do zobaczenia. Majcie się dzień.